Today we will be talking about a very special and popular anime. If you are well informed in mangas and novels, then you must have at least heard of Ore Dake Level Up Na Ken aka Solo Leveling. So before I talk about the anime, I would like to talk about its origin. Solo Leveling is a South Korean web novel written by Chukong. It was first serialized in Kakao's Digital Comic in South Korea and later published by DNC Media. Since 2016, the novel has garnered more than 2.4 million readers. This South Korean web novel got a webtoon adaptation in 2018 and was also selected as the number one webtoon in Picoma's Best of 2019 in Japan. It started publishing as hard copies in 2019. Ranked at 7 in popularity in my anime list, it is the most popular manhwa with a rating of 8.67. Solo leveling also has a role-playing video game under development at Netmarble in South Korea. The anime adaptation was announced at Anime Expo 2022, produced by the studio A1 Pictures and directed by Shinsuku Nakashige with Noburu Kimura writing the scripts, Tomoka Sudo designing the characters, and Hiroyuki Sawano composing the music. It was scheduled to air in 2023 but was later delayed and eventually premiered on 7th January 2024 and on 6th January on Crunchyroll. The opening theme is Level by Sawano and Tomorrow X Together while the ending theme is Request by Karage. And now coming to the story of solo leveling. It starts 10 years ago when the gate appeared and connected the real world with the realm of magic and monsters. To combat these wild beasts, ordinary people received superhuman powers and became known as hunters. 20-year-old Sung Jin Woo is one such hunter, but he is known as the world's weakest. Still, he hunts monsters tirelessly in the low rank gates to pay for his mother's medical bills. However, this miserable lifestyle changes when Jin Woo, believing himself to be the only one left to die in a mission gone terribly wrong, awakens in a hospital three days later to find a mysterious screen floating in front of him. This quest log demands that Jin Woo completes an unrealistic and intense training program or face an appropriate penalty. Initially reluctant, Jin Woo thinks it might make him one of the best hunters. I decided to make this video after watching the first episode of Solo Leveling and not being a manhwa reader, the story looked good to me and animation by A1 Pictures is also good. I would say I am looking forward to the next episode and I would also recommend this anime to everyone who likes fantasy action anime. The anime is announced to have only 12 episodes. Personally, I think it deserved 24 episodes being a popular series as it is. Still, I hope the second season won't come a long time after the first season. What do you think about the first episode and the 12 episodes? Comment your answers below. I will see you in the next video in a few days. Until then, take care and goodbye.